Champagne is cheap. This was only like 40 euros per night. So welcome to the egg room. I am tipsy, guys. <laughs> Good morning guys, um, welcome back to my channel. My friends are going back to Korea today. I said goodbye to them. But I'm going to uh, Lengs. Lengs? Hongs? I don't know how, to, how you say it. Um, I'm going to Sangpanyu to go to the wineries. Korean restaurant here. So the luggage store space is actually near the main touristic place. Wow, it is nice. Oh, it's so cold but so beautiful. This cathedral is crazy. The details. How did they build this in the first place? These are all the kings who are crowned in this cathedral. Wow, this is so impressive. Like everything is so... Everything is art. Oh, it's so different from like the architectures I'm used to. So it's so cool. I have a sound. These lines and I don't know, like everything is so. Wow. Look at all the different like glass walls. I think because it's winter and cold, not really a high season, there aren't many people here. Champagne, GH, Marcel, and Co. The Tangjo. I am here, guys. Woo. First winery tour. It kind of looks like a theme park. So, I am here. Uh, it's like a museum. It's so dry. I'm a little bit excited. They made it really artsy. Every section has like an exhibition, which is kind of cool. In front of the third engraving of Gustave Lemelin, this one is from 1883. You have to know that Mr. and Mrs. Pomery had two children. So, a collection of golden vintages, and it's called Le Nautec in French. And So I'm now taking the train to Erpene, I don't know. Wow, I arrived in Erpene. It's such a hard name to pronounce. It's snowing, so pretty, so pretty, but it's making my life very hard. But I feel like this trip, I'm so lucky with the views. So, my room is in the main street, but this is the entrance and it smells so bad. <sighs> I have to take my luggage up and down. Make sure to check if they have an elevator when you book. So, the place is actually really spacious. There's a, there's a bedroom here. It's actually really cheap for big bathroom 
another bedroom. I like this one. And there's like a big living room and kitchen. Wow, this was only like 40 euros per night. There's a fridge and everything. You can use a stove. It's like in the city center. A really nice view. It's a nice place. Like the view is nice. It's really spacious, like 40 euros for three rooms, a washing machine and everything. But entrance was kind of smelly and the stairs were, yeah. But it's still okay. So I opened the closet and they have the used blankets in the closet. Oh. is so cheap here it's less than two euros this is life <gasps> this is heaven guys oh my god there are so many champagnes you probably can't find in korea 17 euros for a bottle of champagne that's crazy guys this is heaven champagne is cheap <laughs> They're using the same water glass I use at home. So I have my first glass of champagne and the image bush. Which I think they get like a lot of inspiration from like Asian cuisine. So I got my burger. Uh, it's like real meat. Some fries with parmigiano. Burger. Oh, there's the kimchi. That's my room over there. And this is the restaurant, and that's where I ate. The room, which is actually better at night, the water was dripping. It wasn't like a shower, it was like tuk, 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 for the hot water. Bring your towels if you ever come here. But other than that, if you like come with like a group, big group of friends, I think it's like a best option to stay like affordable and you guys can have your own time. Um, so maybe I call it a day because I have a big important winery tour tomorrow, so. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a good night. Good. Oh, nice. The place I brought champagne is just here. My little bed. And craziness. And crazy me. Came from Langs yesterday. Wow, okay. Yeah. Camera ready. Only zero. How are you doing? I'm good, thank you. We decided to do some tests with uh, some old barrels like how we used to do before here in the region. Mm. This is going to become part of our identity. So The MV mm. that it's very popular yeah. too in, in, in Korea. Korea is very yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Yes. Oh, but it's so beautiful. It, 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 does, it gives the like family own mm -hmm. vibe. Yes, and if you have some family who lives in here, like you're going <gasps> to really? We have a oh. trampoline over there for the kids. Kids? Oh yeah. my god, that's so nice. And then in here we have uh, mostly our winery. Uh -huh. On the right we have the the tanks where we usually work on the blendings. Uh -huh. One part you can see some of the vineyards from here mm. too. On the left we also have a, a little hotel that we have five oh, rooms. Oh yeah, I saw. Yeah, yeah. With, a, with a spa. Mm. Well, what is the most popular season for people to visit? So here will be like from, uh, will be mostly summertime. Summertime. <sighs> September. Welcome to our temple. <laughs> I have goosebumps. Well, what makes us so different from mm. other producers? And then oh. nobody here in Champagne went this far in the level of detailing. Oh. A very big impact mm. and a big influence on our wines. Oh. <gasps> 8,000 liters? Yes. So it's a pressing machine that it's only used two weeks in a year. So welcome to the egg room. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so here at Angelo, we really like to experiment. Mm -hmm. And usually 3% of our production, mm. uh, the wines will be destined for the experiments that we're doing. Mm -hmm. So the eggs, they were part of one of our experiments. Perpetual reserve. Mm -hmm. cool. uh, from, we have the wines from 1990 to 2022. The old wines, they're going to educate the new ones. So oh, once we add the expression. yes, ah, once yeah. we add the new wines, they're going to incorporate some of the characteristics of the old ones. Ah, hi there. <laughs> <laughs> you would have had this size here, so but since it was grown in Aragon, it's more compact, uh -huh. so 175 years. Wow. You guys are really experimental. Yeah. yeah. His idea is also to use it with as a as a to do pieces of art later uh -huh. too. Uh -huh. For the, ah. for the lips. And I, this is how we used to close the bottles of champagne uh, before for the aging mm -hmm. in the cellar. Symbolizes uh, the return to the origins, not only using oak. This was... 
Usually this is the best time for the tasting. Mm. Mm -hmm. Wine used to be like an expensive drink mm -hmm. for Koreans. People actually started to enjoy the, mm -hmm. the art of wine. Yeah. I had it with a sushi once. Mm. And it was actually a really good mm -hmm. pairing. Yeah. This is like sesame and yuzu. Good combination. Because mm -hmm. it's PR, mm -hmm. that stands for Perpetual Reserve. Mm -hmm. So the wines that come, it's 100% from the tanks. 1990 to 2019. Mm. Mm. So this is a Stefan. <laughs> ah! Yes. Enchanté. Je m'appelle Denis. Enchanté. Really enjoying it. She's been wonderful with me. <laughs> Enjoy your day. Enjoy your trip. Merci <laughs> Guys, you know, it's not even 12. It's 12. Um, rosé, first time. Put it over there. And then we press. We have very delicate aromas, a lot of freshness. Mm -hmm. Merci beaucoup, thank you. Very nice having you here. Uh, bon here. Okay, bonjour. But I, I couldn't get the one I really like. But I am tipsy, guys. I'm walking around the area. It's such a different vibe from Paris. It's so peaceful. Hey, Togo. So I came to Auvier, they have like smaller wineries and also the, the, the grave of Dom Perignon. It's interesting like all these places are like small champagne wineries, but it's so quiet guys. <laughs> I feel so fresh. I'm sorry about that, guys. Tomb de Dom Perignon. Wow. Wow. But it's nice to see the small wineries. This is the statue of Dom Perignon. This is where people used to do laundry. So we're tasting three different champagnes right now. I think that's the restaurant. Bonsoir. It was in the big room of a uh, uh, Michelin guide. Okay. Okay. Champagne Collet. Au premier cru 2014. And I <laughs> so I ordered some pigeon scallops and I think it was something like truffle. Le <laughs> maroil. So strong. So I just have dessert left. Not my typical like go-to champagne style, but it was still very good. Mm. Wow, well, guys, I am so full, and it was such a amazing dinner. It was a bit pricey, but still very worth it. But now I need to walk off all this heaviness. This is such an interesting concept. So I just went on a crazy shopping spree. I wanted to show you guys what I have bought. Of course, some champagnes. They were like 30 something euros, like 33 euros each. So it's very, very, very cheap. And the next one is from Only Zero. One of them I'm gonna drink while I'm here, but the two I'm gonna take back to Korea. Ta -da! My souvenir from Champagne. Time to enjoy some wine and uh, French snacks. Hey guys, good morning. Um, 
I need to figure out a way to take this back to Korea. If I come back here with like friends, um, I would definitely stay here again. Anyway guys, thank you for joining my trip to Sangpanyu. I hope you guys liked it because I really liked it. I drank a lot of champagne and I'll see you guys back in Paris. Good!